Good morning. I'm Davide Ghezzi. I'm System Engineer at Estimac Electronics. Welcome to this unboxing video. Today we are going to talk about the BlueCoin Starter Kit. This is an integrated development and prototyping platform for augmented acoustic and motion sensing. The kit is composed of three boards. There is the BlueCoin Core System, the Coin Station and the Little Cradle. In the kit there are also a lithium battery, a programming cable and a plastic box. Now let's open the kit so that we can access the different parts. This is the BlueCoin core system. On the top side of the PCB there is a microphone array with four digital MEMS microphones. All the other components are on the bottom side. There is an STM32F4 microcontroller, a Bluetooth Raw Energy radio with the integrated antenna, a 6-axis accelerometer and gyroscope, a 6-axis accelerometer and magnetometer, an atmospheric pressure sensor and a battery charger. There are also two push buttons accessible from the side of the PCB. Let's move on with the coin station, which is one of the two host boards for the blue coin. It has the blue coin connectors, a micro USB socket, a digital to analog converter with a 3.5 mm jack, two ranking sensors with time of flight technology, and the SWD connector to be used with the provided programming cable. The next part is the cradle. On the top side, there are the blue coin connectors, the battery connector, and the voltage regulator. On the bottom side, there is a micro USB socket and the micro SD card slot. The cradle can be used in combination with the battery and the plastic box to obtain a portable device. Now we'll see how to start the preloaded demo. We need to plug the blue coin on top of the coin station, paying attention to the alignment of the connectors. At this point, we can power on the system, connecting it to a PC using a micro USB cable. The blue coin is recognized as a composite USB, virtual com port and audio class. There is a specific driver included in the software package. Since the system is recognized as a stereo USB microphone, you can use any recording software to acquire the audio stream, like we are doing here with Audacity. Now we are going to reprogram the blue coin with a different application using the provided programming cable and the ST-Link debugger included in any STM32 nuclear board. First of all, we need to remove the jumpers from the CN2 connector. Then we need to plug one end of the cable into the SWD connector of the nuclear board. Notice that the last pin will remain free. The other end of the cable must be plugged on the connector on the coin station. Now it's time to plug the USB cable, first the micro USB to the coin station, then the mini USB to the nuclear. The hardware is ready. Let's get the software. Go to st.com slash bluecoin. From the list of compatible software, choose the AllMems1 function pack. Go to the end of the page and click on the download button in the Get Software section. Extract the zip file and you will find the directories with all the required material. Now let's try this simple application that allows us to connect the blue coin to an Android or iOS smartphone app. Just choose the correct binary file and drag and drop it to the nuclear board icon. Now we are going to try this new application using the portable version of the blue coin. We should mount the cradle board together with the battery inside the plastic box. Once we have done that, we can plug the blue coin on the top. To turn it on, just keep the power button pressed for a second. The blue coin will start blinking, meaning that it's waiting for connection. We can now open the STBlueMS app, look for the device and connect to it. We will see the sensor data displayed on the phone. Thanks for watching this video. If you want more information about the BlueCoin kit or the related software, go to st.com/bluecoin.